called monkeypox. It's a rare disease, but should we be concerned? Fox and Matt King explains, and we want to warn you that some of the images are pretty graphic. There's a patient in the Commonwealth uh, of Massachusetts who has been confirmed to have infection with monkeypox. Mass General Hospital announced it admitted that patient to its special pathogens program Monday, making the U.S. at least the fourth Western nation to see a case of monkeypox this week. It can be a very dangerous virus. It's somewhat related to smallpox. Hartford Hospital infectious disease doctor and HIV primary care medical director Patrick Cahill explains monkeypox usually presents with a fever, aches, swollen lymph nodes, and after two or three days, pus-filled blisters on the hands, feet, and face. It's very unlikely you're going to have monkeypox and not be aware that something is going on. New York Medical College School of Health Sciences and Practice Dean and former CDC epidemiologist Dr. Robert Amler expects some of the interest in the only dozens of cases between the UK, Spain, Portugal, and now the United States stems from the word monkey in the virus's name. But monkeypox most often passes to people via different small animals in West or Central Africa. Rodents, squirrels, rats and even prairie dogs. Perhaps surprising in this most recent, still very small outbreak, those infected appear to have no history of travel to Africa. This is rare and unusual, UK Health Security Agency Chief Medical Advisor Dr. Susan Hopkins said in a statement. UK HSA is rapidly investigating the source of these infections because the evidence suggests that there may be transmission of the monkeypox virus in the community spread by close contact. Left untreated, it can have a fairly high mortality rate of up to 10%. Both the UK and the CDC also believe they found evidence of human-to-human -human monkeypox spread through sexual contact between men. The CDC says bodily fluids, the liquid inside the blisters, and anything soiled with either of those items can spread monkeypox. They continue to be infectious for the entire time that those lesions are there until such time as every one of them has scabbed over. A monkeypox vaccine has existed since 2019. Overall, it shouldn't be a high risk for a very widespread outbreak. I'm Matt King. Fox News.